Oh, club fighter. Um, okay. All right. Yeah. So what I want to do now is just fight. Let's go fight. Schedule. Uh. So now I'm gonna slow it down a little bit and start looking at matchups again because it's. Bad as I want to be a contender, I also know I'm not as strong as some of these characters. So let's go. Tommy Morrison. Yeah, the punches are devastating. Okay. Um, well, I did say I had to. Let's do it. It's on. It is on. By doing this fight, I'll actually uh, prove to myself I got what it takes to be a contender. If you can beat George Foreman, you can be a contender. So this is already fucked up. Uh, well, gotta get champion, you already know. Two weeks, there's another fucking two week fight. God damn it. It's okay, and it's George Foreman. Uh, <sighs> That's me slouching back in my chair with with the stricken grief, in case you're wondering. It's bullshit. Okay, that's fine though. Two weeks, two weeks, two weeks. All, all I have to do is get champion during this training session. I hope it's not Banks, because if it's Banks, it's gonna be tough to get. It's just like Morrison. Or Morris. Yeah, it's Morris. This is the other fight, fighter I was thinking of fighting. Right now, not looking too good. Where he just tried to headbutt me. Maybe I'm tripping. Maybe I'm the one that's in the wrong. I'll have to rewatch that later, cause I'm I'm not I can't let that go. It looked like he grabbed my head and tried to legitimately headbutt me. Don't do that. Come on. Have some dignity. Don't clinch on me. Fight. You know I need the points. have some maxed out uh, stats by the end of this training session. Nah. You know, toughness is up there and that's fine. Strength is low. Strength is not great, which means you know, I have to play the counter game, which is not a bad thing. I like the counter game. I can deal with the counter game. There's nobody wants to do the counter game all the time. Uh, let's rest. Uh, 
something I was going to do, but I don't remember what I was going to do. Oh, uh, what was I going to do? I remember. Let's go here. Aha, uh -huh, okay. Know what I want. The Friday Night Fights Tour continues, and we are glad to be here with you. I'm Joe Tessitore, alongside Sorry, I do a little Teddy typing. Atlas, and we welcome you to the Metro Manila Priorities Arena. Here. We're here in the Philippines for tonight's main event. Ten rounds among heavyweights. This should be a really good matchup here uh -oh. tonight. All that energy that we saw it almost boiled over at the weigh-in yesterday. Now it gets to explode here in the ring. Uh-oh. about out of time. We went over the rules in the dressing room. Let's have a good clean fight. Touch them up. Oh, I nailed it. Oh, Foreman. Okay. Yeah, I know how to type. We're in this. Alright. This is, uh... Grill selling for him. And I'm okay with that. He's passing the torch. And he's looking for more of the same. And to he's get big. More of the same, he's got to remember what punches are just are wild. It was the way he set it up. It was all the little things that he did. Very accurate two punch combo by Lee. I'm worried about breaking the top 10. I like that step back right there. Because I, I know I'm going to see Mike Tyson, and that's going to be one I'm not too anxious. Damn, that was an uppercut. I'm not going to be anxious to fight him. Wow, he, I'm glad I freaking slipped out the way of that. That was insane. George Foreman is the personification of a power punch. He is power punching. His opponent says, I can match power. Looks like George power. Foreman still got it a little bit. Dude's not terrible. But I am smaller. And I got to get inside, which is not his game at all. Solid left hand to the head. I'm okay with this. Keep it in the corner. Oh, that hurt. Right That's, That's the downside. Near his we'll take some punches well, trying to keep him in there. For the most part, they'll be on the defense. That's a forceful two punch combo. Go, go, go. Oh. That's a good block by Lee. Threw the wrong punch. I wanted to do a hook. Body shot lands. It was the right. And then try to throw a jab. Bring the hook down low. Able to dismiss his opponent's shot. And then comes back with an uppercut. I'm not strong. All I can do is punch a lot. And try to get him worn out. All right, we're in there. This really damaged his opponent in that last round. Winning this fight. You keep doing what you're doing, and you got this in the bag. Just keep doing exactly what you're doing. Won that round, all right? You won that, all right? Uh, sorry, I had to type something again. Right, you got to let your hands go. You have to. You have to be busy. This, this guy is beating the shit out of you. You have to talk. Ha ha ha. Alright, got it. Nailed it. We're in there. Round two. Let's go for him, man. Multitasking is an effort, and I can do it. But I should really stop typing in front of him. Doing this game stuff. People will be upset. I don't want anybody to be upset. To the head he goes with a left hand. Mad. Could be worse. I could be sucking and trying to type. But instead, I'm, I'm maintaining pretty well. Uh, it's, gonna, it's gonna hit you in your fat boy, your fat boy belly. Let me get you. Get you. Right there. Fat boy belly. Come here. Come here. There you go. Come here. Just come here, Foreman. Come here. Scored well up top. Alright. 
Gotta knock you out. Let's go. Frustrating his opponent with great defense. He's starting to play a little smart here, trying to keep his distance. Able to cover up along the belt line, blocks that one. Oh, what an exchange! Damn. Lee's almost looking foolish that time he missed so badly. with the combo to the head. Move. What a big Damn. This round and he goes down. Can he survive it? That was a slingshot. That's what I'm gonna call that, the slingshot. Intelligently for me, all right. Come on, you're more intelligent than this. Let's go. Aha, well, that's all it takes to put a video. Yeah, yeah, 67. I'm a yeah, we got this. Look, I'm never actually worried. Last fight, I was actually worried quite a bit. Foreman, uh. Maybe I should be worried about his devastating punches when they land. Until then, for the most part, very manageable. Takes one to give one. Uppercut in return. Targeting each other, the exchange was something special. Foreman's rocked by that punch. Keeps his hands up defensively, protecting the head. Foreman's not looking so solid on his feet, and he's clinching. That's a smart veteran move. Give yourself a break. Yeah, to be a top fighter, to be a champion someday, you have to sometimes put your pride all on the side. He's doing that right now. It's not about pride right okay. now. It's about Come being on. smart and surviving. Just keep it pushing. I'm hella quiet right now. It's okay. He got hit right there. Some people prefer no commentary one. gameplay. Solid effort by Lee. Oh, that's why I don't throw straights. Especially against taller fighters. Lee's being so very effective, punching in combination. For some reason, they always throw a jab, and out, of course, it outreaches me. But damn. No better way to use it than put them together. It's uncanny. Good step back counter punch there. Yeah, the double jab, counter punch combo. A shot and then lands an uppercut of his own. All right, we're looking good. Keep it up, keep it up. That's it. looking really good. Nice work, we gotta keep fighting smart. Here. 83 55. Oh, this is over. Start of Foreman's too tired. Four. He Lee. did do better that round. Though. has really carried this fight so far. He's up three rounds to zip on your scorecard. Yeah, I tried pacing myself so I can get some more stamina. Needs to improve that accuracy. Missed with the headshot. How about that left hand? You need to keep that hand. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Got a oh boy. Oh. Oh. He is oh. Oh. George Foreman. Oh. Can he respond? Boom. Wait, one more, one more. Boom! Worth it. He's too tired. He's way too tired. The ref is stopping this fight. 
that's it. Foreman's not going to hear from those judges. He's a knockout. Bigger they are, the harder they fall. I might actually be able to get two fights in this video. I think he was a decision win anyways, but what a good way I think so. To just put a stamp on I mean, I've done it before, yeah, but... Wow, yeah, sure I've out-punched him in every single type of punch there was, the arena, as far as tonight, accuracy goes. It was a good one indeed, and for Teddy Atlas... Under four rounds? Oh, yeah. Oops. KO round four. Oh, it's got to be under round four. I hate that. All right. Uh... Okay, so right now we're actually in November. Uh oh. This is not great. Let me look at that again, just in case I'm tripping. Nope, I'm not tripping. That's not great. Uh. I keep going back through every screen there is. Let's. Rufus Morris is the furthest out, and I still think that's going to give me a hard time. Mexico it is. Because it's the beginning of the year. It's going to do that like one week skip where it always gives you the yearly announced rewards like the first week of January but it legitimately takes out like a training week every single time and I do not know why oh prospect of the year hell yeah watch me oh I'm ranked 10 nice we're good we're good Oh, Butterbean. Farewell. I'm glad I got to fight you one last time before you left. Julio Cesar Chavez. Hey, there's no way I was going to be able to fight you. Being in a heavyweight. It was a pleasure, Mr. Foreman. He passed on the baton. That was a great fight. Oh, I didn't get to fight Holyfield yet. Oh, no. Or Bernard Hopkins. Oh. It's because they're all old when this game came out. Oh, no, not Klitschko. Is this why I'm ranked 10? Because everybody in... Oh, I didn't get to fight Lennox. Oh, no. <laughs> I really wanted to fight Lennox Lewis. That's unfortunate. Oh, no, I didn't mean to go back. Sorry. Dang it. A few of those boxers I really wanted to fight. Feels good to be amongst the contenders. The 
guys go down. I'm actually owning Morrison right now. Wait, this is. Did this dude get super ripped or am I tripping? Is this, this. No, that's Morris. Oh my god, Morrison, Morrison. I, and I called the last dude Morrison. And his name is Morris. Too bad. I can still get champion here. As long as I play it straight. There we go. This is what I wanted. We got it. Don't want to go too crazy. That's excellent. Now I just gotta get champion one more time. Champion one more time will put me back in my peak conditioning. And then I'll be ready to continue on in the top 10. I can't believe I'm in the top 10. Feels good. And I did it in so little time. But still, becoming the greatest of all time is gonna take a lot more videos. Uh, let's, yeah, we need a rest. Then we'll do the exact same thing. 3,000 XP, that feels good. Just to look at. Let's go, Mancini. Feeling good about myself. Yeah, look at how quick those combos are. It changes the game when you're in good conditioning. Like, changes it immensely. I don't know how I missed that punch. He had a slow wind up. I had all the time in the day. I could have still made a punch next week and it probably could have landed. That's how slow that was. And I still didn't get the counter. That was just bad. Throw something, there we go. Don't be afraid. Pick up the pace. Stay away from those. Faster, faster. We're in a good spot now. Nice. Conditioning's back up. We're prime. We're so prime. Beautiful. We're in there. Tell me I'm not ready to be in the top ten. Just tell me. Oh yeah, here we go. What you won't, what you won't. That's it. 
I'm at 64. Feeling good. 66. What's up? Nice work. Nice work. Feeling so good. 91 over. Everything is maxed out. Oh, I feel so athletic. My conditioning is officially prime. Okay, rests. That experience is freaking beautiful. I'm gonna need to use it like right now though. I hope that once I become champion, I'll have uh, some viewership and you can give me ideas on what colors to wear. I know I'm going with just ordinary black and white, but at least I can do is change it up a little bit. Thinking real long and hard about this. This isn't too bad. I like this so far. Those hooks to the body are devastating. All right, we're ready. This is this is it. Top ten. Got a good farewell from George Foreman. Got his good graces. Since he's probably one of the last legends in the top 10, still on this game. <laughs> good evening and welcome to another edition of Friday Night Fights along All right, we're ready. Ten rounds played into the books tonight. Here's the first. Of course, he's coming off of impressive knockout wins. Lee's opponent has to be very conscious of that. Well, I hope so. I mean, they should have done their scouting report if they're conscious okay. of it. We're going. There's a better chance that they don't get caught with the shot that his last opponent did. Good work I've with the whooped Morris in the nice sparring session there. so many times. That's a razor sharp uppercut by Lee. It's almost as if Good this is just going to come there. natural. Get it up, get it up. But I can't talk mess because his record is pretty damn clean compared to most on the game, I should say. He's got the speed. How does the opponent have to deal with that? Well, it's not just the hand speed, it's the foot speed. And as far as that goes, I think the opponent needs to cut the ring down. He is badly there. Knocked the he wind out of you, huh? Oh, a well, this isn't too bad. We're gonna make this quick. We're gonna make this quick. Oh, hey, Adam Blue. Becomes, after that knockdown, you jumped off line. Things kick in. You What's gotta up? start moving that head automatically right now. You don't want to stay in the middle. And makes that nice right angle on that hook upstairs. And now he's targeting upstairs. That's a well scored left hand by Lee. Morris's defense is okay, now serving him well. Nice job Still blocking do. that punch. Right hand downstairs. Yeah, he just got annihilated in there. I was just having target practice at one point. I think I got him with like three or four straight punches. He's hurting. I know he's hurting. Oh! Talk too much shit. No, I'm okay. 5%? Yeah. Okay, he surprised me with that lucky punch. Surprised me pretty good. Okay, no more surprises. Got me with another surprise. I wasn't ready for that. The most important thing is don't let what happened the last round happen again. Correct what you did wrong. 
Exposed! <laughs> yeah, that was great. Boom! And that's why I said exposed. He exposes his body. Just bam. Look how slick I'm looking with that hook, though. That was great. Wide open. Yeah, but you got the wind knocked out of you. You should have took some time on the ground. Well, you gotta know what to do, but what not to do. Don't use your legs. Don't try to move because that's the inclination. Get on your bicycle when you've been hurt. Oh, yeah. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Come on. Come on. Oh, man. If I had hit that uppercut, that would have been it. That would have been it. That was a three punch combo. And he was flailing around like a ragdoll. Morris is, he's hurt. There's no way. Let's go down. Look at the little subtleties here, Joe. What he does is he forces them into a position to stop the punch. And then when he stops, steps back, makes a miss, and comes right back. Morris is stunned and staggered. Big, big shot comes crashing home. Unbelievable. Another one just straight. Oh, that wasn't too bad. I got more of his arm than his body. So maybe he's just too tired. Yep. Of course he's too tired. Devastating punches to the, to the ribs, to the midsection. Can't imagine how hard it is to breathe when you get hit like that. Raising one guy. Actually, never mind. Tons okay. of criticism is going to be targeted on his opponent. Yeah, two ways you could criticize your opponent. One is not that throwing many straights. Technique was not right. Because I know the straight is my weakness. Is more directed to his corner that they didn't warm him up right. I'm gonna one day fight that champion. That's what I'm working towards too. One of these days. No, I'm just kidding. Probably whooped my ass. Been playing this forever. Well, we'll see. We'll see.